गुड इवनिंग माय नेम इज सत्येंद्र एंड वेलकम टू अर्बन स्कूल प्लीज विजिट अस एट www.urbanschool.in इन दिस वीडियो आई एम गोइंग टू शो यू हाउ टू डील विद द नॉन लीनियर इक्वेशंस इन मैटलैब फॉर एग्जांपल वी लेट्स सपोज वी नीड टू सॉल्व दैट फॉलोइंग टू इक्वेशंस 2x1 x2 is equals to e raised to the power minus x1 this is the first equation and the second equation is minus x1 plus 2x2 is equals to um, e raised to the power minus x2 so uh, it's a quite it's a non linear equation and uh, it's very easy to solve in matlab so let's see how we can solve it now there is a direct function in matlab called f solve which can give the value of these kinds of non linear equations uh, without any solving without uh, showing you the internal steps with the given tolerance value and the other options so i will explain each option uh, one by one in the very first step you need to rewrite your equations and make them each equate the each equation equals to 0 uh, this will be the standard form when we solve the non linear equation with the help of f solve in matlab so in this case the equations will become like uh, 2x1 minus x2 minus e raised to the power minus x1 is equals to 0 and the second equation will be minus x1 plus 2x2 minus e raised to the power minus x2 equals to 0 now uh, we also need to define a particular range of the solutions in which we need to find Uh, our solutions for these values x1 and x2 so in this case let's start we have a search uh, uh, range uh, let's say minus 5 to 5 minus 5 and minus 5 for each now to start with matlab open a new page here it is the new page type your function function f is equals to my function let's say my fun So variable x. Now we need to write the equations of what we solve here. What we want to solve here. So here are these two equations: twice of x1 minus x2 minus e exponential of minus x1, and the similar equation with the separated by a comma, semicolon. Uh, then minus x1 plus twice of x2 minus exponential of minus x2 is equals to zero. So these two equations are here, and I need to solve them. so i'll store them with the function with the name my just say my fun dot m i guess i have already a file yes i want to replace it okay that's it now now come back to the command window clear the screen now first of all define your function uh, the range that is uh, minus 5 minus 5 for both then uh, repeat a function f sol and mention here at uh, my function which was stored as a my fun dot uh, dot m and start with the value of the x0 so it should give the answer and here is the answer minus 0.5671 and minus point oh sorry 0.5671 and 0.5671 for both so in this way you can solve the non linear equations in matlab there are few more options like uh, if you use this particular line x comma f value f value the value of the function at the particular value of the x it will give you the value of the function also so let's try with this sorry Uh, I'll explain this. What is this options later on? So here is the value of the x, and the here is the value of the function. Ah, uh, just a second. To go down. Here it is. So you can see the value of the x is here, and the value of the function at that particular value of the x is given here. for both the x1 and the x2 so in this way you can solve the equations the non linear equations in matlab with the help of the function f evaluate so that's it for this video i will explain the 
other uh, related things of this particular function f 